It is a great honor for me to be here with you. Let me briefly introduce myself. My name is Jin Tian Xu, and I'm a master student of Shanghai Jiao Tong University. Today, I would like to talk to you about our research on improving filtered back projection method. A residual neural network is used to design a filtered curve and is trained in an end-to-end -end model. This representation is divided into four parts. I want to begin with the motivation, and then I will move on to the method. Next, I will be talking about the experiment, and finally, we will land on a conclusion. Recently, Sibben proposed a neural network for end-to-end -end training discrete filter kernel in the network learn operator such as Fourier transform and back projection are accurately represented with layers. Therefore, he called it processing learning because it's a processing learning based on the ramp filter. We denoted it as a peer ramp. However, it's difficult to introduce regularization term in this method, which essentially provides a massive solution space. Although this network can learn ram like filter from ramp filter, it lacks the capability to learn an appropriate filter noise projection data according to our experiments. To solve this problem, we will replace filter kernel with a residual neural network and add a dissolved module after filtering. We call this residual learning based filtered back projection network REST FBP. The biggest difference from the peer ramp lies in two modules, the kernel learning module and the rest block module. In the kernel learning module, KNAND is the summation of the ramp filter and its residual part that goes through a two layer fully kinetic neural network. The rest block module is a typical rest network to structure which can further denoise the data in the silogram domain. The structure of above two modules is selected by experiment results. In this paper, we use 5,936 CT images from Nodal's Grand Challenge and simulated the projection data with parallel being Sekani. The training set, validation set, and test set contains 4,795, 823, and 318 CT slice image to validate the advantages of REST FBP with train PR ramp and REST FBP using two kinds of training datasets, which are plotted by poison noise and or Gaussian noise. Then we compare the reconstruction root mean square error of FBP the chain modules with projection data plotted by poison noise and Gaussian noise. From table 1, we can observe that, regardless of the training data set used, REST FBP achieves a lower RMSC mean and RMSC standard deviation than PR ramp and has greater superiority of over FBP under the same condition. It can be seen that images reconstructed by pure ramp are much better. Images reconstructed by pure ramp are much better than that by FBP due to its capability of learning from data. However, REST FBP reconstructs images with sharper boundaries and the lower reconstruction error. Therefore, REST FBP is less sensitive to noise. In conclusion, we have three main contributions in this paper. Firstly, we proposed a residual neural network for representing filter kernel to learn from data. Secondly, we introduced a regularizer to make the reconstruction network robust. Thirdly, we improved the construction accuracy of filtered back projection and the noise measurement.